pandemic and the elections, the search is on now to try and find a way to soothe our nerves and wash away some of that stress. This is why so many people are already decking the halls. Yes, Christmas, but is it too early? From families to businesses, a lot of people getting into the act. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Olivia Preya is on the story tonight. My other grandson, Mikey, he's two. They call themselves the Cheek to Vegas Griswolds. Be rich if I didn't spend money on Christmas decorations. Yeah. <laughs> year after year, Dan McPhee takes a week off work to put together this extravagant holiday display. It's all to bring a smile to those passing by, a smile that's needed more than ever in 2020. I mean, I, I hope people enjoy it. I mean, I'm getting beeps and people are driving by, beeping their horns, showing support. Oh, it makes me feel good, like I said, to see other people enjoying it as much as we do. Star 102.5 is aiming to bring some much needed Christmas spirit as well. For 20 years, the radio station has filled Western New York airwaves with holiday cheer. But this year we kind of thought we could go a little early in light of all the turmoil and things that are going on and maybe we could just make someone's day. At 12.01 a.m. on November 1st, Chris Kringle and Rudolph took over the airwaves. It's the earliest Star 102.5 has ever started playing Christmas songs. I think a distraction's needed because everybody's kind of waiting to pounce. Everybody's kind of at each other. You know, we need to get back to letting people out in traffic and smiling and waving. And while Star 102.5 is bringing holiday cheer to our ears, SNK Holiday lighting is bringing it to our eyes. It's kind of unusually busy. I think a lot more people are wanting to do things just because of the crazy times that we're living in now. SNK holiday lighting has already done double the amount of business than in years past. Strands of red and white are simply a way to lighten the mood. Of course it brightens everybody's day and you know literally and emotionally <laughs> just brings a smile to people's faces. You know, they're Christmas lights. They're fun. Five-year-old Marky is already planning on bringing all this fun to his his house someday. Are you going to do this when you're grown up? Be just like your grandpa? <laughs> Olivia Proya, 7 Eyewitness News.